What's up, my little tattoo tells? How y'all doing today? Well, baby, if you were the Kardashians, these rumors about you guys going broke and the Kardashians show something going on with that might be true. You guys, what am I talking about? What should be a joyous announcement is bringing a lot of questions up. For instance, a lot of hoopla has come out of the Kardashian camp today that guess what? Keeping up the Kardashians or Hulu was extended. Good job, Chris. Where are you at? Over here. Good job, Kim. Or is it? Because when you read the fine print, it pretty much confirms what the streets were saying about something's off with the Kardashians. Hulu did not get their money's worth. And yes, they're extending it, but they're not renewing it. That means that they are working for the same amount of money longer because the ratings weren't what they expected. Y'all, let's get into this. And this is the weird thing that you have to listen to what is being read in these articles. Hulu extends the Kardashians, to which I said, that's interesting because I, listen, if you guys don't know, I will be reviewing Keeping Up With The Kardashians. I also have my Real Housewives of Atlanta recap up if you guys want to hear me burn my mouth. And while we're at it, hit that like button, subscribe. Okay, you know what? I'm going to create value. Just make sure if you like it, hit that like button. So when I read the article, I was like, Hulu extends the Kardashians. Ahead of its third season debut, the streamer has picked up another 20 episodes of the unscripted series. And I said... How can you extend something, but also pick up? That's called ordering a new season. Do you see what I'm saying? So already my mind's like, and this is coming out of the Kardashian camp. You know, they are trying to do a full on media blitz to convince us they are the most successful people that ever successful in the world. Fine. So in my head, I'm like, okay, already you said four words that don't go together, right? Where are we? Um, Picked up, right? another 20 episodes what but you're extending and you're not the, there's no more pay that hundred million is a part of it and I said mm, something is fishy so I went on to look at it right and I read the fine print y'all let's get into this they said Hulu fall this one under water is what Hulu is extending the Kardashians handing out an order for another 20 episodes of the unscripted series featuring Kris Jenner, Kourtney Kardashian, blah, 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 right? Again, the word we're looking for Hollywood Reporter and Planted article is renewed, renewed, renewed. That's the word we're looking for. Extended implies that the current contract will be extended. Again, have you ever heard of any Hulu shows, Amazon, Netflix, actually any show, network or not, saying they extended something. No, the word we're looking for is renewed, but you can't say that because it looks like this is a planted puff piece to make it look like it's so successful when really Hulu wants the benefit of their bargain. If you guys don't know, there were a lot of rumors that Hulu was thinking about canceling the Kardashians. And by canceling, it means you guys are done but even before they do that and this is the weird thing they want 20 more episodes now let's get this right um let's see the kardashian was ordered straight uh was ordered straight to a series at hulu in december 2020 this is very now right let's get into the rest of it because you got to remember that to see what the future holds now they said that um while hulu does not release traditional viewership data says the series premiere of the kardashians ranks as the most watched debut in the history of the platform listen it was very anticipated however here's where they get creative and the show remains its most watched unscripted series in history I said okay that's a little odd. So I went over to their unscripted series, right? And this is reality TV shows. Hulu only has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine reality TV shows. Uh, reality TV. Of those nine, one, two, three, four are actually pending. They've never debuted at all. So that leaves us with an all of Hulu 
five shows. Do you see what I'm saying about this Kardashian media game? It's the it's the hottest rank reality TV show. Um, you only have five on the entire Hulu network. Let's see what the competition is. There's the Eater Guides to the World that ended in 2020. There's the DM Diamlo, you know Charlie Diamlo show, right? That ended in 2021, right? But it was renewed. There's the Baker's Dozen. That's a cooking competition, right? That ended in 2021. And there's Candified, Home for the Holidays. That ended in 2021. And we, of course, have the Kardashians. And oh, also, we have, oh, that's about it. So out of the nine reality shows Hulu's talking about, four of them are pending and have yet to even air yet. Five reality shows Hulu has had in its history, and this is programming they produce, right? Their original programming. Out of those five, three of them ended on or before 2021, right? One of them got renewed. And of course, there's the Kardashians. So the competition was fierce, guys between a reality show for Eater's Guide to the World, a docu-reality, the Demalio show, a cooking competition, another reality show for making candy at home, and of course, a docu-reality of Kardashians. The Kardashians are number one and the most Hulu's ever done. All right, so are you guys seeing where this is going? But there is more, guys, because you know we're going to get more. Now listen to this creative accountant. To date, 20, because they said they ordered 20 episodes, right? Ordered 20 episodes, but they're not paying for them. Because listen, to date, 20 episodes of the series have already aired all in 2022. The show's initial order was for 40 episodes over two seasons. The Disney-backed Hulu splitting the seasons to spread the show across multiple quarters of the year. And keeping its... 10 episode seasons Tuesday's 20 episode order will keep keeping Kardashian streaming on Hulu through season six so they already paid for 40 episodes that's going to be seasons one through four they were supposed to do 20 each season they decide to spread it out to get the benefit of the bargain however these 20 more extended is not renewed even Charlie Dialma D I I can't remember why Charlie D's um show that is on Hulu, which is also a docu-series, it wasn't extended. It was actually renewed. They use the words renewed. So what does this mean? This means the Kardashians had to go to work to justify the $100 million paycheck that Hulu gave them for those 40 episodes because the episode thing wasn't thinking. So now they had to go back to the drawing board, use Courtney as a uh storyline right you know kylie she can't say that she's pregnant again we already know the kid's name now kylie's whole thing is a social warrior for what are we influencing right um kim is i don't know making courtney her storyline kendall she got fat bunny baby now right and of course chloe her episode is her and her best friend that drags her through the mud again it's very interesting to see and it makes you wonder what is going on with the Kardashian empire? Or are we just getting more savvy at seeing, seeing the spoken mirrors? Why did it look like, at least to me, if I was a guessing person, why did their camp plant this story? Why did they want us to believe that it was renewed and such a big success? Is it because they don't want us to know what we all see? Keeping up with the Kardashians on Hulu has been a bit of a disappointment. They can't say they're the number one watched docu-series when you only have one other docu-series and that one was renewed, but it's been on hiatus since. It's been on hiatus since. What's the last time they had a sh the Charlie show came on? It's been on the D'Amelio show. Um, it's been on hiatus since uh, had two seasons, 18 episodes each, and it actually has been renewed. So it's coming on... Uh, it was renewed for the third season, December 6, 2022. So it's coming on sometime this year. So you're the number one. I believe it was the highest rated premiere. Okay. 
there was a lot of anticipation. But as far as ratings, you're saying that it's the number one series across all docu realities. You only have one other. So congratulations. Again, why are they planning this? Why do we need to know this? Something is wrong. It's rotten in the town of Denmark. All I'm saying is Kim better hurry up and get that pop-up store. Courtney already make sure that she gets a permanent skim store. Chloe got good American. Courtney has um good Travis Barker. Kendall got a modern career. Kylie got Kylie Cosmetics, y'all. They better get to work. Y'all, listen, let me know what you think. Are you buying this? Does it make sense? Again, extended. They're working for the same amount of money for longer because Hulu didn't get the benefit of their bargain. But you know what? I guess it's better for being canceled. Anyway, you guys, um, congratulations to Hulu's number one most watched docu-reality show in uh, in their original programming. Sorry, Charlie D uh, D'Amelio. I know I can't say that girl's name. Sorry, Charlie. Maybe next year you guys can beat them out. Competition steep. Anyway, y'all, let me know what you think in the comments, and I will talk to you later.